let's say I have a problem with reliability. Let's say I run a reliability test. Let's see, analyze, scale, reliability analysis. Let me use, let's see, design expectations fit. Throw that in there, hit OK. Here's my reliability results. My Cronvax alpha is 0.638. That is less than the desired threshold of 0 0.700. So what do I do? Eh, throw it out? No, what you can do is go back and do that reliability analysis, but go to the statistics here and click on this, scale if item deleted. What this is going to do is it's going to tell you what if you deleted item one or item two? What would your Cronbex alpha be then? Hit OK. Our Cronbex alpha is still 0.638, but if you look down at this table here, the last column it says alpha if item deleted. Well, our Cronbex alpha actually goes down if we delete one, two, or three, but look at this. If I delete item four, my Cronbex alpha will shoot way up to a 0.839. So let's do that. Let's get rid of number four here, and then rerun the analysis. Look at that, my Cronbex alpha is now 0.839. We can keep doing this, um, but it looks like at this point, if we remove an item, the reliability actually decreases, so we wouldn't want to do that. But that's how you check to see if there's a way to improve your Cronbex alpha, your reliability. Hope that helps.